Hey, what's up you guys? Uh, just thought I'd do a quick video on how I mount my LCD screen to my light truss. Um, I've been wanting to do this for a while and never got the chance to do it at uh, my gig, so I decided to do it in my backyard. Beautiful day today. It's about 15 degrees Celsius. Uh, for you Americans out there, it's probably around 65 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, so that's it. So this is me uh, mounting up my TV on my light truss. My light truss is only about 6 feet right now. Uh, I did decide to put it up in the air. But one thing you have to be very, very cautious about is the way you have it positioned, your feet of your stance. I try to spread them out as much as I could. I was watching actually one of Brian S. Red's videos, and he says to have the bottom posts right here um, pretty much horizontal. I leave them a little bit up. I mean, it's pretty wide right now. They're probably about three and a half feet uh, between each foot of the uh, stand, and that's adequate, especially when it's about eight, nine feet in the air. Um, so that's it. So my uh, stand holds about 200 pounds. Uh, I'll give you guys a little uh, walk around and to show you how I set it up in the back. <clears throat> One thing that is very, very important whenever you are mounting this is you have to have the supporting pins here. I put both of them in. There's one here, and there's one here. Very, very important, just in case this thing slides down. Hopefully it won't, but you can never be too precautious. Um, and that's it. So what I did is I went out and I bought a uh, LCD uh, mount, wall mount. And of course I had to modify it, like everybody else who mounts uh, one of these TVs on their light, po uh, light stand. Sorry. Um, what I did is, I don't know if you guys can see this right here, but on the other side here is where the knob is to turn. Um, I had to drill a hole through the bracket itself to be able to attach to the light truss. And uh, that's pretty much it. And on the other side did the same thing. One thing that's very, very important to do is to have the inner tubes uh, installed here. Because it's although it's not that heavy, it's only about 35 pounds, maybe about 40 with the bracket, once you start hanging all your lights and everything up, uh, it gets pretty heavy. So I've got about 100 pounds in all with my lights. Um, just my two insignias, uh, the barrel rolls, they weigh about 20 pounds each, so that's on both sides. It's 40 pounds. Plus the LCD, I'm already at 80. So you guys got to watch that, um, especially when you're buying these light stands. Make sure that they support at least 150 to 200 pounds. And uh, that's it. My laptop there with my graphics running. <coughs> beautiful day here in Montreal uh, and that's pretty much it so that's it from the side give you guys a little walk around and what it looks like and that's it I can't get unfortunately I can't get any of the uh, the graphics I got a little asteroid uh, graphics thing going on there I don't know if you guys can see that it's spinning around but uh, the sun's glaring in my eyes it's a beautiful day today <clears throat> and uh, that's pretty much it so thought I'd make a quick little video showing you guys how I install my light, or my, uh, sorry, my screen on my light truss. And, uh, this is a great addition. Uh, I know a lot of you guys now are starting to do this, but up here in Montreal, uh, I've gotten compliments that this is the first that they've ever seen, so I'm not one to say that I'm the only one here in Montreal that does it, but, uh, thanks to YouTube giving me great ideas, I decided I'd do it myself, and, uh, so far it's been a hit. Everybody enjoys it, and, uh, and that's it, especially for the weddings. People love to see it. We snap pictures of everybody and we put it on the LCD screen. And uh, while people are up there dancing, they get to see how uh, how they look, especially when they're uh, having a couple of drinks in them and having a great time. That's what it's all about, especially when you're doing weddings and parties. That's what we're in it for, eh? to entertain the people and uh, to make everybody happy. So that's pretty much it. And uh, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye.